Welcome back to another edition of Fly Tying for Beginners. Today we're going to tie a garbage bag peacock caddis. The hook I have in advice is a standard dry fly hook. This is a size 14. I'm going to use 70 denier olive brown thread. This is a dark olive thread. We're going to put a brace of thread down to the rear of the hook. First thing I'm going to do is tie in a rib, and this is extra fine copper wire. Then I'm going to take a single peacock hurl, and I'm going to tie that in by the tip. And we're going to bring our thread up the front. And we're going to keep our thread about one eye length from the eye of the hook. We're going to take our peacock curl and we're going to wrap that forward. I'm not putting any head cement on the shank because I'm going to have a rib on there and that will work fine. I'm going to wrap this pretty tight. Want to get that pretty nice full body there. It's okay if you wrap back through it a little bit. Just want that body to come out nice and full. I kind of got a little space in there. I just go back through it and bring it forward again. Go ahead and tie that in. And we can break off the excess. We're going to take our rib and we're going to counter wrap this. We can take one turn at the rear first and then I'm going to bring it through. Palmer that up there. Three to four turns should be enough. Going to secure that. You can fold it back and wrap on top of it and break it off. Now I'm going to take our tan grocery bag and I pull the end so we have a skinnier end there. I'm going to hold a little bit to my side and let that thread pull it over to the middle. I'm going to take it, I'm going to fold that in half. I'm going to take my scissors and I'm going to cut that about the length of the hook shank which puts it a little longer than the body. Now I'm going to take a ginger hackle. This one is a furnace. This is very small. Nice ginger hackle. And tie that in. We're going to give this a wrap. We'll give that three or four turns and tie that in. Going to hold it back and wrap in front of it to lock it in. And then break that hackle off or cut it off if need be. Go ahead and give that a whip finish. Just about three turns on the whip finish should be good. Give that a little bit of head cement. I'm 
put a spare hackle through the eye because I know I got some on there. And now you can finish fish it like this, more like a skittering caddis, or you can cut off the bottom if you want to fish it in slower water, which I usually do. So I'm going to just trim the bottom off. Here we have a garbage bag peacock caddis. Hope that you learned something from this video. Hope that you would subscribe to my channel. Please refer me to your friends. Leave comments, questions, suggestions, and most of all, thank you very much for watching my videos.